The technique that I'd like to show you in this video addresses life issues. These are issues that involve relationships, career, destiny, purpose, and overall health. Anything that involves your life in general as a whole. Before we begin, I want to remind you that the most accurate color ray testing that you can do will be using a color ray test circle. This is a circle of gems that contain one each of the color ray bearing gemstones plus white barrel. This particular technique allows you to use any answer receiving method that you know, and it will get you started working with the color rays at a very introductory level, but that's okay. So to do this technique, you will need a set of the seven color ray sprays, and this is the sample set of the one ounce bottles, but you could just as easily use two ounce bottles. And of course, you'll also have to know how to do an answer receiving technique. This could be anything like muscle testing, intuitive testing, using a pendulum, anything like that that works for you. Okay, so to do the procedure, you first of all think of a life issue that you would like to work with. So, um, let me just think a second. Okay, I've got one. I'm not going to share it, but it's very present in my consciousness. And then you hold your hand at the top of your chest. I've got a necklace on. I'm going to hold my hand under my necklace. And, it, and you want to hold it so that it's high enough that you're, also, you're touching your collarbone. You're not exactly over your heart. You're, you're higher up than that. Okay? Now what I'm going to do is find a color ray that resonates the best. And I like to use a pull-in technique. I'm going to try pulling in with each of the sprays, and as you can see, it was the indigo that came up first. So what I'm going to do is spray overhead. Actually, I wanted four sprays. And as you notice, I've closed my eyes, and that's important because you don't want the spray to get in your eyes. I'm just feeling the mist rain on my body. Take a deep breath, drink in the color. And you can take anywhere from 30 seconds to several minutes just contemplating how the color feels and how it relates to your particular issue that, you, that you've chosen. Okay. Put the indigo back, and I'm going to test again. Yellow came in. I'm going to continue down the spectrum. Okay. Yellow overhead. That was just once. I have my eyes closed as the mist rain downs on me. Just sensing the color sensing my body, drinking it in, and sensing it shifting, beginning to loosen things up. Every experience, every life issue, every situation, every emotion, memory, and thought in involves color. It involves spectrums, and spectrums affect all of those things. So when we work with color rays, you can actually start working with shifting the spectrums that are affecting your life experiences. Let's see what's next. Green comes in. Closing my eyes. You may have noticed that when I spray overhead I do different numbers of sprays, maybe different orientations of the spray bottle, and that's something that, that you can learn to do as you get more refined with your technique. Very different scent the green has than all of the others. Orange comes in, green, blue, indigo, violet. In gemstone therapy we always test all seven colors in rainbow order starting with red my eyes. Hmm. 
I'm feeling this sense of kind of relaxation washing through my body. I get the sense that, you know, everything's going to be all right. It's a good feeling to have. All right, I'm going to test again. Orange came in. Overhead, eyes closed. I'm definitely feeling a lot lighter. Just lighter. Not lightheaded, just lighter. Okay, orange is coming in a third time. Spray overhead. This one wants to go really far away. You can refine your technique by deciding how much distance away from the top of your head to apply the spray. And then as I said, how many, how many times to do the spray. And sometimes there's a geometrical pattern. Sometimes it's in a triangle. Sometimes it's just a line. Um, sometimes it's just one spray. It could be to the left, to the right, or center, forward, or back. There's variations. Or if you're just beginning, just spray overhead. <laughs> now because this is the third time that orange came up, my next step is to look for a source of color ray nourishment that can give me ongoing orange ray support. And I have here the color nourishing necklace. This is the orange ray nourishing necklace. It has finest carnelian with white quartz. I'm just going to wear this for the rest of the day. So if you're an advanced gemstone therapy student, you'll be able to work more comprehensively on the life issue with the condition placement protocol that you learned in Practitioner One training and or provide chakra spectrum evaluation and correction techniques. Just to reiterate, for best results, take a minute or two between each color ray spray application to feel the effects of that applied color on the energies that are surrounding the issue. Think about the properties of the color and how it might influence the issue or how it might suggest a step to take toward its resolution. My name is Isabel Morton. I hope you enjoyed this technique. Thank you for watching.